Let's do it, baby! To be honest with you guys, it's sometimes a touchy subject for people to talk about, but it's no real secret. Most of us want to do it, and most of us are doing it. Let's be honest. But narrowing it down to you younger guys that are chomping at the bits, virgins, guys that, hey, I want this so bad, you're ready to go ahead and jump in the sack with a girl. You don't know how, how to quite go about doing it. You have to take the proper precautions, all right? Because listen, when it comes to sex, it can cause a lot of issues. Believe you me. So here we go, all right? Let's talk about the disclaimers in talking about scoring with a chick, all right? Remember, you have to take precautions because there's things out there such as diseases, unwanted pregnancies, and things of that sort. I'm gonna be honest with you, I haven't been so lucky I have a kid or two because of unprotected sex. I haven't had any venereal diseases or anything like that. No, I got lucky, all right? But you have to be careful, guys. I wanna try to be a little transparent when I'm talking to you about this. It's a very touchy subject. Sex is a monster, okay? So take the proper precautions so that you can alleviate yourself of any issues brought on by yourself by not being responsible. Okay, now that we've gotten all the paperwork out of the way, let's do it, baby! Okay, with that gesture, that brings on the first thing we need to talk about. Calm down. Calm down. Don't be overexcited, guy. Take it slow. Take your time. Calm your mind. Because sometimes it can get you so crazy till you can get yourself wound up to the point where you're not going to get anywhere with the score. Now, the first option in which to score is probably your best option. And any good mother will tell you, and a father will tell you, to propose and get married. Will you marry me? All right, so that's not your schmoo, all right? You say, hey, I want to drive a couple of cars before I actually buy one, all right? I get it. Fair enough. So this chick you've been liking for a little while, you kind of got some chemistry going on because she likes you as well, but you want her physically. Go ahead and shoot your shot. Just ask her. Just ask her. Say, look, Joanne, um, we've been going out for a little bit. I, I really like you. Um, you want to hook up? You want to have sex? Just, just ask her. There's no shame in asking what you feel. And she's probably been showing you signs that she wants you to ask her, but you haven't asked her yet. And she's like, it's about time you broke the ice. Just ask her. Just remember, you don't have to be a bozo in asking her, being rude or being nasty or something like that, because that's going to automatically turn her off. Women are quick to notice douchebags. And if you come off that way, she's going to be like, look, you could have asked a little better than that. You know what? You're a creep. Get out of my face. You get none. Another way to get yourself some, <laughs> or rather to score, is to create the mood. All right, if you've been dating, if you've been together with her, y'all are a couple, all right? Y'all are together, together. Invite her over for a nice, quiet night, okay? You want a little music, a little dinner, a little candlelight. Maybe you want to take her out and bring her back to the house, all right? If she so chooses to come home with you, all right? Guys, listen, this is a very touchy one because you don't want to mess up or do something that is going to make her feel like she's being threatened or she's being pushed into something, all right? Know the person that you're with, okay? Know her. Now, upon knowing that, you might want to create the mood, like I said. Creating a nice atmosphere which makes her feel comfortable about feeling a particular way towards you, feeling for the moment, maybe a nice kiss, a nice hug, you know, or something like that. Something that's going to create the mood for her to go ahead and slide into your bed. I'm going to make this short, guys. Last but not least is to not try at 
all. You're probably saying, what the hell does that mean? All right, guys, there's some instances in which you're not going to have to lift a finger in getting things started. Why? Because she's already a beast and she is ready to go. So there's nothing you're going to have to do except to do it because she is going to be ready and she will let you know you're hot you're gorgeous i love the way you look i love the way you talk i love the way you move i like your car i like the things you do i like the way you make me feel let's get down and with that being said that wraps up Yet another episode of Top Mail. As always, I am Keith Jason White, your host. Guys, I want to remind you, sex is something that you really need to be responsible about. None of us are perfect. Nobody's trying to come off perfect. Nobody's trying to act like, hey, I do things the right way when it comes to sex and I don't know. No. We're all human. I just ask that you take the proper precautions in alleviating yourself of any problems that sex can bring about. Guys, be responsible, be respectful, and stay out of trouble. And don't do anything that will land you in a bad place such as jail. As I said before, sex is a beast. I would like you to subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell notification so that you will know next time I upload. Give me that thumbs up. It helps put me in the algorithms, guys. Until next time, I will see you at the top.